Hi everyone, today I will be reviewing SanDisk Ultra and a micro SD card which is rated for 48 megabits and it's a 16 gigs capacity. It has also category 10 which is nicely packed and uh, you can see it's an Android and on the box I bought it uh, cheap for uh, for uh, for five US dollars here in Romania let's unpack this it's got where the strip line is Here we go. And this should slide up. Yes. This is also packed. I will be removing the This is the card says that it's made in China it's the 16 gigs I hope it's not counterfeit because the Sandix has a really bad I will be testing it on my rig with this uh, USB 3 reader from Kingston Mobile Lite G3 then, and I also will be comparing with and Samsung 32 digs it's same category it's a pro and it uh, has a little more saying than the I've been using this for a while it's made in Korea this is just made in China this I've bought for um, uh, 50 US dollars about 3 or 4 years ago and uh, I have replaced this with the new Pro which is uh, rated for higher speeds let's get to the PC and start testing this the SD card is formatted by default in FAT32 it has usable capacity of 14.8 I will be testing with HDTune Pro 5.5 and the uh, Crystal Disk uh, Mark 5.1.2 the 64 bit version first I will start with crystal disk mark I didn't mention but uh, I bought this for my dad he has a uh, Galaxy S3 and uh, it uh, has only 16 gigs and he needs a little bit more space for his photos and uh, the 48 megas, megabyte uh, speed rating is not a problem because uh, onboard memory doesn't even reach those speeds on the phone uh, even my uh, uh, Samsung 32 gigs pros didn't ever reach the high speeds And 
it's taking quite a bit to fill one gig. I think because it's rated for five tests. As we see, the sequential read reached 45.36, so it's near 48. Didn't expect to really reach the speed. Even the random read is good. really curious on the writing speeds if they reach the rated even the new Samsung Pro SD cards they are rated for 19 or 80 megabits read and write on the PC they actually reach but when connected to the tablet I have a note 12.2 Pro it doesn't even reach the internal speed of the card which it's kind of disappointing because you actually are buying the SD cards for the devices not to use on the computer because uh, when connected to the computer you you actually can get faster speeds for lower money on uh, uh, USB sticks which don't need uh, an adapter which already has an USB 3.0 support As you can see, the read and write speeds are quite are quite well on both of them. Twenty eight megabits is um, compared to an USB two point external hard disk drive. As you can see, the sum question right is 43 and uh, 26. It's almost uh, as the rating on the
in the card itself the write is also good but uh, you don't write so often on a device as you read them let's test the HD Tune, HD Tune Pro I will test only the read as you can see it's pretty consistent so as you can see the minimum transfer rate is 42 the maximum is 43 the crystal mark and the HD tune had the same results and uh, random access it's compared to all of them uh, is pretty much the same on all six on the read on 4k and uh, 41 on one mic and when you have uh, a mixed when you're transferring photos you have uh, when you're uh, reading out photos you have around 40 it's pretty well pretty good uh, thank you for watching uh, I hope you enjoyed this video, uh, see you again later.